The Class AA title game on Friday night in Wheeling. Bluefield looking to complete an undefeated season, taking on Fairmont Senior, the Class AA runner-up from a year ago. First quarter, Polar Bears get the ball first. Their opening drive, Connor Neal throws over the middle. His pass caught in stride by Antonio Parsons. He is tackled inside the red zone, and Fairmont Senior would capitalize. Bryson Gilbert taking the handoff. He heads toward the far sideline and is able to break several tackles and score from 13 yards out. The PAT is no good, but Fairmont Sr. is on the board first, 6 to nothing. Bluefield's first drive, Chandler Cooper pitches to Mookie Callier, who's able to find an opening for a big game past the 50 and a first down. And then from the 9-yard line, Truck Edwards with a play that would make SportsCenter's top 10, breaking several tackles and scoring from 9 yards out. And the Beavers take the lead for the first time, 7-6, to six, still in the first quarter after forcing a turnover on downs. Collier takes the handoff, able to get by one defender. He is finding space on the right side, goes past midfield, cuts back inside, finding more space on a 60-yard touchdown run, and Bluefield would have the 14-6 lead after one. In the second quarter, the Polar Bears would answer. Gilbert going to his right, and he would score on a seven-yard touchdown run. The two-point conversion is also good, and that means the game is tied 14-14. But the Beavers are quick to drive downfield with Edwards recording his second touchdown of the night. Beavers retake the lead. 21 to 14. Still in the second quarter, Neal with a screen pass to Caleb Walker, who is able to get past several defenders and score for the touchdown, but the PAT is no good. Bluefield still leads 21-20, but the Polar Bears do recover the fumble on the ensuing kickoff, and on that drive, 4th and 23, Neal going left to Gilbert for a 32-yard touchdown. Fairmont Sr. would have the lead at halftime, 26 to 21. Third quarter, Polar Bears looking to add to that lead. Neal loses the ball on the one, recovered in the end zone by Edwards. It remains a five-point game, and in the fourth quarter, Bluefield now on the one-yard line. Cooper able to score on the QB keeper. Collier adds the two-point conversion. Beavers take the lead 29-26. to Ensuing drive for the Polar Bears. Deal from the shotgun under pressure, but the Beavers defense able to force a fumble and recover. However, Fairmont Sr. would create a fumble themselves and recover, so they would have one last drive on fourth down. Neal looking over the middle for Parsons, but Collier with the pass breakup. And Bluefield High School, for the first time since 2009 and the 11th time overall, are the Class AA football state champions. It's just crazy. I mean, we were down at halftime, and, and Coach Salmon just told us to stand up for each other and be brothers, what we work for all, all year long. And uh, I mean, Mookie and Chuck played so hard. Our offensive line played hard. That's a really good football team. And, and so we just really give God all the glory. So thankful to have each and every one of these players. I'm thankful for them. And God bless me to have such an amazing coaching staff, uh, you know, high school, community, teammates. And, he truly has been great to us, and I hope he continues to bless every single one of uh, the players on the team. Well, I'm sure the Super Six enjoyed this game. I mean, I'm telling you, it was it was back and forth, and, and usually two really good football teams is going to be that way, and just you hope to come out on top, and we did. We just need to make a play, and we did, and I'm, I think we did fantastic. How can you how can you fault what we did? It was great. But I'm proud of them. Proud of our staff, proud of our players, man.